Monday everyone and happy August 1st. Today is a fun food vlog day and I'm with my little cousin Kaylin and y'all probably know Tristan by now. But we are at this place called Liberty Kitchen um, an Oyster Bar in the Heights in Houston and heard a lot of good things about it. So we are here trying it out. Um, thinking about getting the Hawaiian Pokey, is that how you say it? I don't know. I'll, I'm gonna figure that out, but I'll get back to y'all and let y'all yeah. know what I decide to order. Yeah. So stay tuned. Oh, <laughs> oh snap. What's seafood mac? It's gonna come with shrimp, crab meat, and fried oyster on top. Mm. <laughs> Just got my food and I ordered the Hawaiian poke. Yeah, yeah. Is that how you say it? Pokey? <laughs> Uh, I don't even know don't what I'm know. asking. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> yeah. okay, it's okay. Okay, okay, okay. So, yes. So I ordered the Hawaiian poke and I got the salmon with the veggies and some mango. Has tomato, corn, kale, avocado, and um, red beets and uh, salmon. Did I say that? But it looks really good. Oh, and spicy mayo. And Tristan is in heaven oh, right now. Look at that. Goodness. Look at that. Look at the cheese. Look. Look. That macaroni nice. though. Oh, Tristan's okay. in heaven. Yes. All right, so I'm gonna enjoy this lovely, lovely meal. Okay, are you ready for the first bite? I'm ready. First bite. I've been ready. Zoom in. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. <laughs> mm. Mm. You good? <laughs> you good? <laughs> mm. Oh my God. I'm gonna have to taste that. Oh what is that? What is this? Oysters. Oysters. Mm -hmm. Got some oysters on top. Oh, oh my god. All right, you know what? I just have a feeling this, this is going to oh get messy. God. I'm going to go ahead and grab the fork instead. Or the spoon, whichever one comes first. All right. Here we go. This is absolutely amazing. Really? Can I try some? Yeah. All right. Let me get a little bit. Oh my god. Oh. It's so good. Ah! <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh my god. That is some good macaroni. Oh my god. Wow. With the green onion. <laughs> <What? Crazy. laughs> yes. Alright, it's my turn now. My turn. Okay, Alright. Yeah. So I get some avocado, some mango, some fish. Try to get a bunch of it. Have one crab bite. in it. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. Mmm. 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 That mayo is spicy. But it's good. I'm gonna eat this. Maybe check out the dessert menu. <laughs> and uh, head over to the second spot. <laughs> and then we'll move on to location two. So we're at Lee's Fried Chicken and Donuts, but we're only here for the donuts. And um, <laughs> I'm getting many people staring at me right now, but it Probably. happens, you know, uh, we're because food critics. <laughs> we're food critics. <laughs> we should be. <laughs> we might as well be. Yeah, so uh, right here it says H-Town Hot Chicken, but like I said, we ain't here for the chicken, we're here for and donuts. Here for so I decided to get the Butterfinger Donut, and uh, here we go, voila. As you can see, it is a normal uh, donut here with some chocolate drizzles and some uh, crushed up Butterfinger on top of some white icing. And I'm going to taste it now. I'm going to taste it. Are you ready? Three, two, one, eat it, eat it. Mmm. Does it taste good? Mmm. It's chewy. And it's sweet. Very, very sweet. But it's good. So. It looks like I have a dimple. Oh. Okay, ready? Right. So this is a uh, blueberry, blueberry lemonade. lemonade. And then that one's Mexican chocolate. So we're gonna try this one first. Ready? <laughs> That tastes like a snow cone. It does. It's really light it's and very refreshing. Light. It reminds me of summer. It's a good summer. summer ice cream. Wow. Very good. That's really good. Okay, okay, Mexican chocolate. Mm -hmm. Ready? Yeah. Mexican chocolate. Here we go. Oh, okay. All right, this is... <laughs> Ready? Right. Yep. Hmm. Mm. I can taste the cinnamon. And it's I not can... like... I normal guess. chocolate chocolate. Yeah, what? it's like cocoa. By Lee's Creamery. Oh. By Lee's Creamery. Lee's Creamery. Right here in the Houston area. Oh, it's yeah. handmade right here in the Houston area. 
<laughs> we're at, did we tell them that? We're yeah, at we Lee's. did. We're at Lee's Fried Chicken Fried and Chicken donuts. and Donuts, yes. Okay, so, I'm gonna ask you first. What is your favorite quality about Tristan? All right, my favorite quality about Tristan is her outrageous personality. <laughs> I have one of those. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it makes things interesting everywhere we go, and uh, it brings out the outrageousness in me. Oh. oh. <laughs> okay, Tristan, your turn. What was the first thing you noticed about Chelsea when you met her? <laughs> Let's see if I remember that. We were in the gym. Mm -hmm. And I was like, Courtney, she's kind of quiet, I think. She was very quiet. Yeah. I think that was the first thing. And she had really nice hair. Oh. Oh, well, thank you. Okay. Fun fact, guys. I was very quiet. Very So, quiet. along with that question, when was the first time you guys met? Okay, so the first time we met was at the rec at the University of Houston. And I believe she was working out. It was a workout beast back in the day. Yeah, she was working out like crazy. I think it was, it was way before I got into working out. You you were like wanting to start though. Yeah, I was like around the time of like wanting to get in the gym, but I had absolutely no idea what to do. Uh, but she worked out a lot, and I think I was with my friend Courtney, and Courtney introduced yeah. me to her, and I uh, just kind of blossomed into something that we weren't expecting. Randomly. A very random friendship, so. Did, did, I don't, did you expect us to be like, no? No? I, <laughs> I didn't think, either. I think that what happened was uh, I was going to Miami for spring break, and it yeah. was like my first spring break without my family. And I didn't really have friends to invite. <laughs> so I was like, you know what? Tristan seems like a really cool person. Let me see if she wants to go. And she was down. I'm and she's down. she's always down. We have like a not really a ritual, but like uh, an annual uh, spring break trip together. Yeah. Uh, the first one was Miami, then it was Cayman, and then it was Belize this year. So we're trying to plan our uh, our fourth one next year. It's gonna be Where um, should we go? Where should we go? Let us know. What's your favorite trip that y'all have been on together? Mm. So the, my, I guess the favorite trip for me that we've been on together, I, I probably have to say K-Man. K-Man was fun. I have to say K-Man. K-Man was a lot of fun. But Miami was fun too. Miami was a lot Miami of fun. Miami was real fun. Mm. Which one do y'all remember Belize the most? Cool too. <laughs> I don't know. We're just really good travel buddies because we, we both like to eat. That's why we Yeah, travel. that's true. As you can see, yep. when we're together, there's always food somewhere. Food in there. involved. All food, the time. food, food, food. Yep. So I, I guess it'll have to be like a triple tie. Yeah. yeah. Does that make sense? Yep. Mm -hmm. They're all fun. Okay, this one's for Tristan. What's your favorite thing about Chelsea? Hmm. <laughs> there's just so many. I can't just choose one. You know? <laughs> okay, I know. <laughs> <laughs> my laugh is very outrageous. Okay. My favorite thing about Chelsea is that she is such an easy person to talk to. Um, she has great personality and great insight and she's not like me in a sense like you can actually go to her for advice. I'm just here for comedic relief. <laughs> <laughs> if something's going on I just Chelsea, my life's in shambles. She's like, gives you great advice, you know? And As for me, friend. she's like, Tristan, help Make me. me. And I'm again. like, wanna she's go eat? Like, <laughs> Perfect. Yeah, so that's that's our relationship. Yeah. But thank you. I didn't know you liked so many things about me. Or about me. Yeah. <laughs> Awkward. <laughs> I love Chelsea. How long have y'all been friends? Since 2011. 2011? <laughs> Five years. <laughs> Do you ever feel like you're gonna get tired of each other at some point? You know what? I was wondering, like. I got tired of you a long time ago. Okay, yeah, <laughs> but no, really? I was just thinking about that today because there's like some people that I, that I hang around like a lot, a lot, and then like we start to like argue and bicker because one, like, we know each other, like, we get to know each other so well, or like, we just around each other all the time. Me and Chelsea, we never do that. <laughs> like we never like, we've never gotten an argument. Yeah. So. Yeah, and I, I can say the same about Tristan because like, 
I don't like I've never actually like had a best friend. I mean I had like a junior high and elementary <laughs> <laughs> I know I had a sad life, okay? I wasn't very social. But uh, in like high school and stuff, like I had like my good friends, but I consider them good friends because like I like talk to them in school and text them and stuff. But it, I never really had someone that I can like go to for anything. I have a good friend that I met uh, my freshman year of high school. Her name is Courtney, and she's been like my big sister. But you know, like with family, there's only certain things that you can say to them, you know. And that's that's kind of how it is because she's like protective big sister. Um, but when I met Tristan, she's like, like the cool friend and the big I'm sister. I'm the cool mom. And the cool, but I'm not considering her a mom, so that doesn't that doesn't count. But yeah, so her, I can go to her for, for anything, and we've been together for so not together. But Ew. Like, <laughs> I mean, like you know what I mean, like friends Too much together. Too much what do you think about my dating life? Like from the outside looking in. <laughs> I'm just kidding. What's your um, perspective? Okay. How would you describe it? Ahem. If any of you guys are single and tall <laughs> and like to wear suits and maybe white as well, um, <laughs> message me and I'll send it over to Tristan. She needs help. <laughs> so uh, yeah, that was fun and. Um, we, you know, enjoyed our ice cream. We enjoyed our donuts. We Chelsea, enjoyed... what's your favorite thing to do? My favorite thing to do, I like to sing and get down on it. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> the song's playing right now, oh, so I did that. Oh, oh, okay. My favorite thing to do is uh, travel and eat new foods. That's why we friends. That's why we friends. That's why we friends. That's why we friends. We're here at the colored wall now, and it was literally like 15 minutes away from the donut place shop. Yeah, okay, do, doing that again. Okay, and it's windy, and it smells like burnt corn. We're at this place in Houston called the colored wall, and as you can see, it is a brightly colored wall behind me. So Tristan and I, and Kaylin, <laughs> she, we're gonna uh, take some pictures out here, and hopefully some real cool stuff. So that's going to conclude this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe. And I love you guys so much. Have a great rest, great rest, great rest of the week. And I will see you guys in the next one.